My question now is what were the ones doing all these years, calling themselves my therapists? It was an awkward situation. I saw his superior in that factory throwing paper planes at me. He saw him doing so too. He knew I saw him witnessing his boss doing that. He asked me to understand it was his boss and so he could get fired. He told me he had a kid. I told him there is actually no in between. You are supposed to get me full pardon right away. I then told him I was willing to play it this way. I saw that the time given is recovering from my disease as a compensation I might never get. It was obvious right from the start I never accepted any of his words written in their book. One was talking about compensation I might never get accepting this recovery and second chance shit. Showing them my words were true and his boss really very bad throwing a paper plane at me. It was after some years more and more impossible for him to stay in between. Now I was really disappointed he started to be a third man. Like he was saying I know my boss throw this but I think it is better for myself to make money out of my rich boss his fail and saying I saw him throwing a paper but I did not saw it hitting you, so I am not really involved, I am pretty sure then he now the worst, he did the same to the Spoonbill, I know you lost got there with him, but if you give my son some beautiful marks, I will say again I did not see the plane thrown hit him, it was maybe something in the blood test that explains why he felt hit, this turning to the mosquito as a third man and blackmailing the old men, was a thing I did not expect a good flamingo would do, of course this all fantasy, he just the postman giving me the papers that set Scorpio strand me free, this what a good girl does, what was I thinking, anyway the mosquito blocked by diving bell spider and Uranus spider, he too has no power at all, he can take a look inside, but there is nothing to see but his own cold prison cell at the nick and of course outside there is kiwi chick showing him the surreal paintings of the white hair, if he thinks those paintings should hang in the hermitage he can ask canaryman and polar bear for permission, but it is crowded there in St. Peberg wall, many old masters hanging there, and really this white hair stuff simply not the level of a band blog, my question now is what were the ones doing all these years?